The killing spree terrorized Salinas from 2015 to 2018. A crew of gang members calling themselves the Murder Squad killed 11 people and injured 17 others. They hunted down people who they thought were part of a rival gang, but turns out many of the victims killed were not gang members. Back in 2020, at a press conference, Salinas Police Department revealed seven of the victims killed were innocent people caught in the crossfire. They were simply everyday residents of our city that happened to be in a public place while the murder squad was on a hunt. On Wednesday, the U.S. Attorney General's office announced five members of the murder squad were sentenced to a combined 161 years in prison, convicted of racketeering conspiracy and conspiracy to commit murder in aid of racketeering. In addition, each member is ordered to serve five years of supervised release once they get out of prison. Selena's mayor, Kimberly Craig, who was a city council member during the squad's killing spree, remembers how the horrific violence impacted the community. As a leader of the community, you want to provide a, a safe and livable community, and that is just not what we were facing at that time. Mayor Craig says these convictions are a step in the right direction, but there's still a lot more work to be done. We've worked really hard to earn the trust of the community, um, finding justice today for the victims and their families was part of that healing process so that we can move forward. Salinas Police Department says there's still a lot more uh, investigations that may be connected to these murders. Reporting live from Salinas, Leslie Duarte, KSBW Action News 8. Leslie, thank you.